Abhishek Bachchan and Aishwarya Rai Bachchan against Google and YouTube over AI-generated deepfake videos signals a growing crisis around personality rights in the age of artificial intelligence. Thus videos which depict them in fabricated and sometimes explicit scenarios, highlight how generative AI blurs boundaries between truth and manipulation while eroding reputation, privacy and economic autonomy. Personality rights traditionally protect a person's name, image, likeness and voice from unauthorized exploitation. Rooted in dignity and privacy these rights evolved to curb commercial misuse. But AI technologies especially deepfakes have magnified vulnerabilities by enabling identity theft, misinformation, extortion and trust deficits. While AI promotes creativity, unchecked use risks turning identity into a commodity. Globally, personality rights are fragmented. Europe follows a dignity-based model the US treats them as property and India adopts a hybrid approach. In India personality rights flow from Article 21 and were affirmed in the Putaswamy judgment. Courts have gradually recognized AI-based infringements through cases such as Amitabh Bachchan v Rajat Nagi, 2022, Nil Ur v Simply Life India 2023, regarding AI misuse of his likeness and catchphrase, and Arijit Singh v Codibal Ventures 2024, which protected his voice from replication. However the legal framework remains reactive. While the IT Act 2000 and the 2024 intermediary guidelines address impersonation and deepfakes, enforcement is challenged by anonymity, cross-border data flows and weak platform accountability. In the US, the right of publicity is a transferable property interest enabling celebrities to monetize identity. Recent reforms such as Tennessee's Elvis Act 2024 ban unauthorized AI cloning of voices or likenesses. Lawsuits against character AI revealed harms including self-harm encouragement and psychological manipulation leading to courts rejecting First Amendment protections for such parts. The EU's GDPR mandates consent for personal and biometric data, while the 2024 EU AI Act categorizes deepfakes as high-risk tools requiring transparency. China too is tightening regulations recent Beijing court rulings recognize voice as a personality right and penalize deceptive synthetic content. Scholars argue that AI's transnational nature surpasses national laws calling for extended personality rights that include style and persona. UNESCO's 2021 AI ethics framework emphasizes dignity and non-exploitation. Academic critics note India's fragmented laws and urge statutory definitions, watermarking, platform liability and high-risk classification for deepfakes. As AI innovations grow, India needs comprehensive legislation explicitly defining personality rights, ensuring digital safeguards and global cooperation, so identity remains protected without stifling innovation.